normally, pregnant women are advised by their obstetrician to be taking a prenatal vitamin. And so they're assuming, therefore, that they're getting all the nutrients that they need. And these prenatal vitamins contain vitamin D. We documented that 70% of the time they were taking their prenatal vitamin, they were getting 600 units of vitamin D a day. And we showed 76% of moms, 81% of newborns were vitamin D deficient. And why should you care? Because one of the most serious complications of pregnancy is preeclampsia. And there is now very good evidence that vitamin D deficiency markedly increases risk for preeclampsia. Caesarean sectioning has become popular. So we did a study again at our hospital and we showed in over 200 women giving birth, they had a 400% reduced risk of requiring a C-section if they simply were vitamin D sufficient at the time that they gave birth. A major health cost to the, the healthcare system is premature births. And there's now very solid evidence that if the woman is vitamin D sufficient in that magical range of 40 to 60 nanograms per ml, that would require pregnant women to take 4,000 units of vitamin D a day. They have the maximum chance of not having premature birth. That the gestational age is much longer in women who are vitamin D sufficient. So I recommend to all of my obstetrician friends and all pregnant women that I see in my clinic, they should be on 4,000 units of vitamin D a day along with their prenatal vitamin and any other sources they may be getting from drinking milk or whatever else. This will not cause toxicity, will improve the health and welfare of the mom as well as the developing infant.